Man United owners the Glazers must heed Roy Keane advice after Ole Gunnar Solskjaer hint. Manchester United boss Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has hinted that his midfield could do with a revamp after conceding a sloppy goal against West Ham and the club's hierarchy might be wise to listen to Roy Keane's advice. The complaint could prompt the Glazers to go after Declan Rice, a player who Keane has touted as a future United signing, in order to plug one of the last remaining gaps in the Red Devils squad. At the London Stadium, Fred and Scott McTominay were criticised for not closing down said Ben Rama before he opened the scoring. Defensive midfield is still a position in which Solskjaer tinkers regularly, while there are barely any weaknesses in other areas of the pitch. After the game, Solskjaer said, we still have to defend better. We have to make it harder to break us down. Their goal, the structure was wrong for whatever reason and we'll have to work on it. Read more, Man United hero Roy Keane breaks character with Jadon Sancho sympathy Scott, Fred, and Nemanja Matic are natural team players that will do anything for the team and plug holes wherever there is one. Rice would be a prime candidate to strengthen the holding midfield at Old Trafford, having continued his stellar form at Euro 2020 into the new season with the Hammers. Former United captain Roy Keane has heaped praise onto the 22-year-old, believing that he could be one of the final pieces to the puzzle as they go in search of silverware under Solskjaer. I think he would improve United's midfield, he told Sky Sports. Don't miss Manchester United still hampered by £52 million problem despite dramatic West Ham win Gary Neville questions Del Alley application as Tottenham full asleep for Chelsea opener what David Moyes and Mark Noble said to each other before West Ham penalty miss versus United Declan has improved more than any player I've seen over the last one or two seasons. He's 22 and I look to where I was, I think he's way ahead of me when I was 22. I think the next step will come to him when he plays a higher level, and when I say higher level I mean for Man United, playing in Champions League, competing for trophies. Rice was a man in demand virtually all summer, although the pound's 100 million price tag pinned to him by West Ham effectively stopped all interested parties in their tracks. As it stands, his contract runs until 2024, so even next summer the East London side will be under no major pressure to offload him, unless the pressure comes from the player himself. Ultimately, his performances for club and country have been so consistent that 2022 may finally be time for him to fly the nest and make a step up. If that turns out to be the case, it is highly unlikely to only be United knocking on the door to sign him, although it is evident that there would be a place in the starting lineup for him. Chelsea were also heavily linked with him this summer, although with Saul Niggas lured in on deadline day, the Red Devils' task of luring him in could have been made that bit easier ahead of 2022. And if United follow